And it was very unfortunate because we were held up at the start of the men's 200 meters because the guys that were in heat semifinal number one were involved in an accident. A T-boning occurred. And unfortunately for, I guess all of them were okay, but unfortunately, Andrew Hudson, the Jamaican champion, you know, he had some glass that went into his eyes. He ended up finishing fifth, but you know, the World Athletics in, in what is, is only rightly an important thing. They advanced him into the final. And this is also the good thing of having a nine lane track. So he's into the final because he was rightly complaining. He had to be, he had to get, receive medical attention. He wasn't seen properly. And I know some people might say, well, maybe he would have, he would not have gotten into the final. We don't know, but it, it, it's really unfortunate for these individuals. But how good is Noah Lyles? I mean, impressive really easy 1976 that is out there and i think he was trying to shut it down and i'm wondering to myself now is he really in a 192 shape because part of me is saying if you want to run 192 if you want to get to close to that usain bolt record which i'm still not quite sure you can get to at least not after rounds after doing the 100 and this but maybe Lyles is just in a kind of shape that he's really trying to get close to that. I don't know. I just don't know. I mean, like, I just can't wrap my mind around it. But after I saw that 1976, I'm, I'm getting a little, I'm, I'm starting to wonder how fast he's going to run because it's going to be competitive. He easily won that race and there's not really any competition there. But can Lyles break the world record?